Enjoy this delicious holiday how-to. It may be the holiday season, but today I'm going to show you how to make these colorful, delicious drinks you can make any time of the year. Today we're mixing up some colorful holiday drinks. Now these drinks aren't just for the holidays. You can actually make these any time of the year. I've just picked a very simple cocktail glass that I've dipped in a little bit of water. Now alternatively, you could use some lemon and just kind of rim the edge of that glass. I have dipped it in some crystallized mint. This is a uh, herb crystal by Chef Rubber that's all natural. And I'm just gonna simply set that off to the side. I'm gonna grab my champagne glass and I'm just gonna repeat the process. But this time I am using a cranberry uh, crystallized a little sugar crystal that goes on the outside of your glass. It's so delicious. It really adds so much flavor and it's all natural, which is great. So you don't have to worry about any artificial coloring, especially for those people that have allergies to color. Next, I'm just going to simply take my cocktail glass. I am going to grab some tongs and add a few ice cubes to my drink. I find that the perfect drink is one that is nice and chilled. So all of my liquids that I'm using in my drink, whether it be the cran raspberry or my champagne or the vodka, they've all been chilled. I like to actually keep my vodka in the freezer. So it's always guaranteed to be nice and cold. So once you get your glass filled up with your ice cubes, we're gonna move on over to our cran raspberry and we're just gonna add a nice healthy dose of our cran raspberry to our drink. Now obviously we want all of our guests to drink responsibly so I tend to measure out my alcohol when I'm you know making drinks for a party that I'm throwing. Um, I just like to make sure that everybody is safe. So I'm just going to measure out my vanilla vodka and I'm going to go ahead and add that to my cocktail glass that already has my cran raspberry in it. Next, I'm going to add a nice splash of orange cello. If you've ever had lemon cello, this is quite similar, but it's got a really nice orange flavor to it. So again, that's orange cello. And to that, I am going to um, add my little stir stick and give it a good stir. I want to really incorporate that, you know, all of those flavors. I want to make sure the alcohol is not sitting on top. I want to make sure it's nice and incorporated. Once I've given it a good stir, I'm gonna go ahead and cut up some fresh strawberries. And I'm just gonna add that right into my drink just to add a little bit of color. Now, alternatively, you could put some fresh mint in there, which would be really pretty, or you could actually take the fresh cranberries and, and float those in the cup as well. Our final step for this cocktail is we're just gonna simply garnish it with a fresh strawberry. This is a really refreshing drink with the mint and the strawberries, the cran raspberry, very delicious. Um, the orange cello really comes through in there, balanced out with that vanilla vodka. So moving right along, we are going to create our champagne. And what we're doing is we're just going to take a pretty flute. We've rimmed it with the cranberry crystals and we're just gonna add some champagne and let those cranberries float right to the top. Very simple, but elegant and delicious. Now remember, these holiday drinks can actually be enjoyed any time of the year. Just remember to always drink responsibly. If you have any questions, feel free to jump on Epic Delights and ask your question. We'll get right back to you. But until next time, make it sweet or savory, but always delicious.